Alrighty, so I have some sad, maybe exciting news to announce for you today, depending on how you view it. Um, but yes, Orbiter at Canada's Wonderland is closing for good. So I did email the park to get an official um, announcement on it, just because we can see it in our drone footage. They're deassembling de it, storing it in the parking lot. So I wanted to get you guys an official statement. So we're not just speculating on this for a week or two weeks um, continuously. Let's get the real answer. So Orbiter had its last season in 2018, and it is currently being dismantled and removed from the park. As you know, these decisions are difficult ones, but we regularly evaluate our rides and consider downtime, resources required for ongoing maintenance, and overall guest satisfaction. There are no immediate plans for a replacement attraction on that plot of land. So that's an official statement from the park. So a huge thank you to Grace Peacock for giving me that statement so we can just nip this in the butt and uh, finally learn what's going on with Orbiter at Canada's Wonderland. Um, so as you know, in the previous video, I speculated on what could be going on. Obviously nothing's going to happen immediately. The main reason for Orbiter being removed is strictly because of maintenance and costs and guest satisfaction. So as you know, Wonderland and all theme parks track how many guests ride their rides. It's called ridership. Um, and when those numbers start to get low, they think about removing those attractions, especially when those numbers are low and maintenance costs are high. And that is one of those rides that was definitely in that category. So that is why Orbiter is leaving. It's not leaving because it, you know, blew apart or it broke or <laughs> um, anything like that. It's just an old attraction. It's not very popular and it has a high maintenance cost. You're going to see a lot of these attractions removed in Cedar Fair. They set it in a stockholders call. Um, so this is very normal. So as you can see, Orbiter is being deassembled and stored in the parking lot right next to Yukon Striker's beautiful trains in this zoomed in picture. Um, so um, yeah, uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed this little quick update on Orbiter. I wanted to give you guys the official announcement on what's going on with Orbiter at Canada's Wonderland. It will not be returning for the 2019 season and it will not be returning, period. Um, so with that said, we also have a Yukon Striker update for you guys coming tomorrow. We got some awesome drone shots with the snow melting so we can finally make out what they're doing on the land. Woof! And uh, yeah, hopefully you guys look forward to that. We have an exciting new series out of Europe coming on Saturday called Downtime. So hopefully you guys are looking forward to that as well. And Jasm's um, ride history on Matterhorn bobsleds is coming out tomorrow. So it was a little bit delayed. Uh, I was supposed to come out today, but this um, had to be released. So we have some really awesome videos coming out this week. Hopefully you guys really enjoy them. Thanks so much for joining me on Amusement Insiders and watching our videos. If you're new, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to hit that like button and uh, comment down below what you think could be replacing Orbiter in the future. Um, it could be a flat ride or a coaster replacing maybe Mindbuster and Orbiter's Land or is it just going to be a pathway? Who knows? Comment down below what you guys think. Um, and again, hopefully you enjoyed this video. Hopefully you had an amazing weekend. Have a good one, guys. Bye.